Welcome back everybody to Galactic Science. This is episode 6. Right, as you can see, the transfer node over here, I have made an awful lot of world interaction upgrades. That means every tick or two, I am getting 28 pieces of cobblestone going into my crafter, which is getting pumping out heaps of elements. Uh, a metric ton of the silicon, lead I've got lots of. I've even got to the stage of actually having to void off oxygen. Uh, just before, I've actually moved over my chemical synthesizer from the other room over here to here to automatically synthesize silicon dioxide. That's getting sucked down into this hopper, which eventually, well, actually, that's going to be the, uh, the focus for right now. I need to make another chemical synthesizer. Uh, for that, I need an awful lot of iron, um, pistons. I'm going to need uh, for quite a few of those too, and some wood. I've got some spruce saplings here. I'm going to go outside and make some uh, spruce trees, I think. Those trees are, were actually really, really good in my last tree farm that I was using. But this is actually working really, really well. Right, uh, let's go out. And also, uh, th one thing I'd like... Oh, hang on. Ah, that's right. This is a bit of a hack one can do if one has a, a set of shears. You basically shear the infested leaves. You get the string and the leaves at the same time. And you can put the leaves back down again. The, uh, that's the whole idea of actually having these pieces of wood here. So the leaves don't despawn straight away. So with that uh, little plug of leaves I've got, I managed to get 46 of them back. And I've got 28, 25 pieces of string. Not bad from nothing. And I can put these uh, infested leaves back down again and repeat the process. It's not, it's actually a lot easier than actually uh, using the old uh, silkworms, but um, yeah. Right, uh, one thing I don't have is an axe. Whoops. An axe would be definitely handy. Do I have any, oh, actually I've got sticks on me. <laughs> right. Let's make myself an iron axe, because I can. We're going to clear out the trees down here and start growing some spruce trees that should help me uh, gain i suppose well once we get the uh, two by two spruce trees going we'll have more than enough wood so we're just going to clear clean out my little uh, uh forestry here get rid of them all or at least enough so i can actually get a enough dirt going at least for the two by two which that should be more than enough Yep, there we go. Up and up. That should almost be enough wood, well, basically to keep get us going anyway, to uh, get the um, chemical synthesizer. At least that's the plan, anywho. Right. Dirt, please. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, there's another piece there. Right. So, one, two, three, four saplings which I'll have one there and I have one there uh, I'll have to run them back into the house grab some bone meal because yeah bone meal will make, make the process a lot quicker for one and for two I got bone meal to spare so it's actually good if I just get rid of it all right come on there we go spruce tree all right pop this one at least four saplings when they all fall to the ground. Okie dokie. Yeah, four spruce saplings. Nice. Boom. Haha. <laughs> nice. Alright, let's chop him down. And we should have more than enough wood to uh, get our chemical synthesizer up and running. And then, after that... Um, my god, this is actually taking a while. I fear not to move. 
and then after that I think we'll actually go back to the quest book and actually look at some of the other quests of the things that we can actually do there look at all that wood look at it it's wood raining for days that's a screenshot if I ever saw, saw one might have to use that for my thumbnail okay all the wood all the shaplings the uh, the tree farm I had in the last run was using uh, spruce sap, um, saplings for and uh, that actually used to run really really well I mean just from one that one two by two I get 19 saplings out of it not bad not bad at all I really should actually make myself a door for this place actually what I really should do is actually seal the place up we'll see how we go for time we might be able to make an oxygen sealer yeah let's just check the star mm, 9 million RF I can keep going with that for a little while I've got to make some uh, more aluminium wire and some sealers as well yes we'll try and go for a sealer this episode right now let's take oh I don't know a few stacks of iron from here oh hang on ah I see a problem just a small one I actually need another synthesizer or two because I kind of goofed up I've definitely goofed up on this one right let's hope I've actually got enough iron to uh, looks like I will actually will I uh, the answer to that is no I'm gonna need some more iron well let's go back here let's grab the broken iron ore from this sifter I made another secondary sifter just thought you might like to know all right Yes, I'm just going to throw this in straight away. I, I'm also made, making a lot, a lot of smooth stone lately. I could actually synthesize the smooth stone. I don't know if it's even possible, but I'll look into that. Actually, that'll be a lot darn quicker, no doubt. Right, so that's going to be cooking up the iron. So that's enough for the pistons and a few, few more. So I'm going to need some cobblestone. Easy enough. Um, yeah, I'll take two of those. Compressed cobblestone. Da da. Um, probably not going to be enough. Try go grab some more, eh? That possibly could be enough, right? Uh, redstone, I've got. Iron, I've got. Yep, yep, yep. All good. Right. Let's take a stack of wood. Synthesizer, one of those, piston, eight, exactly, lovely. Uh, right, so one of these, click that, yeah, I'm learning stuff. Right, I uh, just need a diamond, I'm sure I had one, not in here. Actually, I've got enough for that diamond block, so I can actually get the plans for the uh, space rocket, so... Hmm, tier two is looking pretty close. I could almost taste tier two right about now. Right, uh, I came in here for what? Diamonds. That's not the that's not the chest I'm looking for. Right, okie dokie. Ouch. Now I'm going to need. The iron from here which is just enough if I remember rightly boom love it one extra synthesizer which I'm going to put here because I need to use it <laughs> all right let's halve that up halve that up again place that there because I want more iron Ta-da. right Boop, boop, boop. And this is probably about after about a couple of hours of decomposing um, the double compressed cobblestone. It gets me 36 ingots of iron, which is pretty good for absolutely doing a bug, sweet bugger all. And I've still got 31 stacks of the stuff. 
Now, what next? I could actually make myself some more power. Um, I would probably actually make myself, make myself another chemical synthesizer, maybe. Hmm. But first, let's see. Is there actually any quests in here in regards to actually making my environment more oxygen sustaining? The answer to that is probably no. I don't think so. But... For convenience sakes, we're going to do that. So we're going to get a sealer. Is it an oxygen oxygen sealer? Oh, I'm going to need something called a compressor. Right. Let's go that way. Uh, compress. Right. Oxygen compressor? No. Um, compressor. Electric compressor. Okay, compressor. Oh, shit, I'm going to need a basic wafer, which needs a circuit fabricator. <sighs> I believe this is actually a part of a quest too, no doubt. Right. Uh, aluminium, okay. I think I've got just about... Oh, I've got all that right here. It looks like. Uh, the only thing I don't have is the redstone torch. Which it can be remedied. Right. Good, good, good. And I think there was a lever involved with that. And, lo and behold, two buttons. Conveniently, I've got everything on me. Uh, what? Oh, everything except the furnace. But I've got a, a few that uh, was made previously. Right. So, boom. Circuit fabricator. Yay! Um, well, that lava's nicely covered, so I'm actually going to put you right there. Right? Now, this is definitely a quest. I am damn sure of it. Yes, it is. Yay! We get rewards. Uh, I'll pick the middle bag. We get a diamond, yay! A greater reward bag. <gasps> what do we get? A filled fuel canister. Um, yay! Uh, whoop de doo. <laughs> uh, let's go let's shove that in this. Um, should we put it in this chest? Yeah, why not? I have to condense my all my um, inventories into some sort of system. I dare say. They're still uh, pretty insistent on using this storage system. I'm really not a fan of it, to be honest. But, oh well, I've got to work with what I've got, huh? Or I could try... Oh, wow. No, I have tried putting Applied Energistics into this mod pack. And uh, it didn't work very well. Right, I need a compressor. So, compressor... Yeah, my main problem with actually trying to put uh, Plate Energistics 2 into this uh, pack was actually Meteors. Um, basic Waffer. So, Silicon. Uh, right. There must be another way to make this Silicon. Raw Silicon. Okay, duh. Right. Okay, Galactic Craft Silicon. Easy. I have that. That I do have. Right, so, the uh, silicon, the diamond, and what else did I need? Uh, red, okay, redstone, redstone torch, so redstone, and some redstone torches. Well, i got a feeling I'm going to be using more of these basic wafers, so... There, it's fabricating. Joy. Right, so what else did I need while that's going? Um, copper ingot, alum, lots of aluminium, and a little bit of copper, and an anvil. Right. Actually, can I make the electric uh, compressor straight off the bat? <sighs> no, I can't. Cheese and whiskers. Um, hmm. Right, I suppose I'm going to need some copper, eh? Well, luckily I've got some more right here. How 
about that? Now you could actually well, both do what I'm doing now and cook up some copper ore. Or you could actually use the copper from the copper chest I got from a quest reward earlier. But I'm just going to use that. I'm going to go dig around with my other chest for some more aluminium because I'm pretty sure I've got some, some of that lying around. Namely in the place where I, I make most of my cables. Okay, so that is definitely enough there. Now for the anvil, which is... Woohoo! I reckon we're in luck. Actually, maybe not. <laughs> maybe not. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Ooh, yep. Just have enough iron for the anvil. Nice. So, anvil. Oh. It's not going to work. I have to make the anvil manually. Let's sigh. Right. Anvil. Now, uh, I need to get that wafer, and I think I've got everything else, so everything else should be good. Alright, jump. Yep, make that jump nicely. Basic wafer, thank you. Right, so it's... Copper ingot to start off with. <laughs> right, copper ingot, done. Aluminium... Aluminium, Wefer, and Le Ambel. Done. Compressor. Well, this compressor can work anywhere because it requires power. Power in the name of coal. Or anything burnable. Well, I got lots of coal here. Eventually, I will be moving these uh, sieves to a building behind this wall over here. So. I have to expand this uh, room out, outwards, somehow. Somehow, some way. Right, now, the electric compressor, and he's an advanced wafer, which is a redstone repeater. Okay, so, redstone repeater, got, I've got all that. I think. Right, need some more sticks to start off with. The uh, redstone. Okay. Ba -ba -da -ba -ba. Right, so that's the redstone repeater. Good. Got that. Uh, I think I just needed another diamond, if I remember rightly. Yes. Another diamond. Ah. Bogre. I want to jump straight to, straight into the uh, the electric uh, ver variant. Right. So that's that. Um, yes, let's go duck for some air. Do, 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 do. Good. Right, and uh, let me see. Yep, diamond. Okay, good, good, good. All right, uh, we'll take the redstone torch out, put the repeater in, the diamond in, and away she goes. Right, then, let me see, oh, I'm, I need more iron. Well, luckily, I have a few more stacks of this stuff. So we'll just start throwing that stuff in there. I could actually em empty up my inventory just a bit. Um, let me see, it's that. I could put the gravel in there, get rid of it. Um, the flint, I'm actually going to chuck straight into the decomposer. Wow, I'm t this is going superly well. A constant stream of uh, chemicals going in. I'm probably going to have to be avoiding off lead, chlorine, sodium, and titanium. Uh, titanium will have a use later. Absolutely. Um, right, but let's get into the business of getting some more of this iron into the synthesizer. Doo -doo -doo. Like that. Boom, that's nearly a stack. Lovely. 
So now we've got to make ourselves up another anvil. Yippee! Do, 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 do. Right, anvil done. Da, ba, da. One, two, three, and four. Done. Anvil, sweet. Uh, now for uh, the, the uh, compressed bronze. So then we've got to get compressed copper. Uh, right, okay. So we'll go to the compressed copper. That'll be fantastic. And then I have to get compressed tin. Which I've got some uh, tin ore here. I got a lot more tin ore there. Awesome. Yes, I, again, could have hammered this down for more, but uh, I really don't have the patience for it. Right, so that's our compressed copper. I have to wait for two... <laughs> I have to wait now. Uh, what else can we do while we're waiting? Get the enough things for compressed... Well, compressed iron we can do. Just have to grab some more... Um, iron, by the looks of things. So let's clear some of our space out. I could probably put that oxygen into the jabber barrel. That'll free up a space. Right. I actually made, even made myself some lead blocks just for fun. Because I had so much lead just to kick in around. Right. Um... So that's that, that's that, that. Yes, I do need to clear out my inventory. I am well aware of this. Right, so that, I've got all the uh, tin. So we'll sit here and wait for this to work. And then I could, I could basically, basically steal uh, coal from here to make the compressed uh, steel plates that I need. Do, 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 do. I'll probably end up making more of these uh, compressors because it's really good, nice to actually have uh, more compressors than you, than you really do need. So two, three, and four. I just need all those. The one, the beauty of the uh, the electric compressor is you can actually feed it twice as much and it'll do it in the same same time as the normal compressor. Also, with the added benefit of actually using power. And I wonder if that's even a quest. It is too. Oh, we even get blocks of iron. Oh, good damn it. All right, we'll claim our reward. Thanks for the blocks of iron, which I could have used earlier. <laughs> Oops. Um, I could really do with another chest here. Yes, siree. Uh, four. That will get me enough for a double chest. Yay. Alright. There we go. Let's get rid of some of this stuff. Shears I don't need right now. Um, don't need the basic wafers so far. Okay, I can actually go up to the fabricator here and grab my advanced one that I need. Right, so that's four there. One, two, three, and four. And fueling, away we go. Awesome. Let's go see what's in our bag. Oh, yay, 128 limestone. Hmm. I wonder what I can break down the limestone into. I don't know. I really don't know. Right, so we're waiting on that so we can make the advanced one. Let's check our quest book. What, uh, okay, seal me in. Oh, good, yes, there is a wonderful quest for the oxygen sealer. How are we going on time? Hmm, let's see. Can we knock this out today? Uh, sealer. Uh, compressed steel, which I could do. Compressed aluminium, oxygen vent. No, that looks like I'm going to be needing a lot of extra compressed things, so I probably best wait for another episode. 
So uh, the plans for between this episode and next, automate sieving. Basically, you get these sieves, make up a another chemical synthesizer again, because I need one just for like basic pottering around. Have that underneath the, this uh, synthesizer here, and we're going to be making pretty much straight um, gravel to be fed into the automatic sieves. I could probably, I think I might make up a couple more of these, and uh, it will expand this. Um, workshop room whatever uh, maybe have another door we're going to try and go for like multiple rooms so i can basically have a sealed oxygen areas that's going to be the plan though i f think i don't know how i'm going to do this because i've got a feeling this room's just about as big as it's going to get if i can actually transport items through a wall somehow I could actually with the hopper here possibly who knows all right folks thank you all for joining me for this episode of galactic science i shall see you all next time